quick review of a project I've been wanting to get to for a long time. Ten thousand watt peak, seventy two hundred watt continuous generators project that I've been wanting to do for years. Channel iron. Fabricated uh, rolled uh, maybe eighth inch or three sixteenth steel. Generator head from Harbor Freight. Riding mower motor from a riding mower. Someone uh, didn't know how to keep running after sitting up over the winter. A muffler from a generator that I was trying to quieten down a few years, a couple decades back. Anyway, I'm hoping to keep it under four foot in length. I may add a deep cycle battery and an inverter, 2,000, 3,000 watt inverter so they don't have to run the generator just to do a drill motor or something like that. But I'll be able to run the house or tools or whatever off of the uh, generator. Should be able to run my welding machine off of that generator right there. That's a 21 horse motor. 16 is required for that to operate. That 21 horse motor there will be more than enough. I'm uh, going with a 5 inch on uh, pulley, double pulley on the uh, generator head itself and a 6 inch on the power plant there in order to get the RPMs from 3600 on the engine here down to 3000 and that maintained 3600. Peak torque on the Briggs type motor there, 21 horse is just under 3000 RPMs. So I'm bringing the RPMs down from 3600 maximum operating speed down to 3000 and near to the peak horse, uh, peak uh, torque. And uh, that should make it run more stable and add a little more life to the engine. And uh, loading up the generator shouldn't pull the motor down as bad running near the torque band. Anyway, that's the project. That tank's going to be too small for my purpose. I've got a maybe a 10 gallon plastic tank from an old scrap jet ski I used for parts for my other one but uh, that's the project I did find a flaw fixed a wall leak on it where is a crankcase ventilation or crankcase uh, opening up filled with JB weld so that no longer has a wall leak and it runs clean should last for a long time. More to come.